and welcome to No Recipe Required. Hope you're doing well. I'm Dave, and tonight I'm going to do a, a mashed potato recipe for you. Now, it's not the normal mashed potatoes, which I love. They're great. Probably have them once a week. My wife loves them. I also, uh, you know, I look for ways to spice things up. Obviously, garlic mashed potatoes, everybody's had that. What I'm going to do for you tonight is actually a blue cheese mashed potato. Uh, really, no, no, no more difficult than regular mashed potatoes. Let's, uh, let's go ahead. We'll start, uh, we'll start cooking the potatoes. Okay, so just like I do with um, mashed potatoes every time I make them, I've got uh, my potato cut in roughly equal pieces, and I'm going to um, I'm going to start them off in room temperature water, bring it up to uh, you know a light boil, and just let it, let them um, simmer until they're cooked. Then um, you know the real magic with the uh, with the mashing with the uh, blue cheese all comes after this. So let's come back once we um, have these cooked and strained. All right, so I just drained off my uh, potatoes. Now's the time to mash them. And frankly, you can mash them in, uh, in whichever way, standard way you want. I actually like to use these, uh, these ricers. I think it gives a, uh, a really nice texture to the, uh, to the potato. What I'm going to do is go ahead and just uh, mash these up. I'm going to add, I, you know, my, my uh, pot is still on the heat. I just turned it really, really low. I'm going to add just a tablespoon, a couple of tablespoons of cream to the bottom of the pan. If you want to use milk, you can absolutely use milk. I'm going to finish ricing uh, or mashing these potatoes up there. You can do the same procedure with a potato masher if that's, uh, if that's your preference or if that's what you have. Once we do this, we'll do the seasoning, add in our blue cheese, and we'll be, uh, we'll be good to go. Alright, so here we go with our blue cheese mashed potatoes. I've got my potatoes riced. I put that little bit of cream in there. I'm going to turn the heat back up a little bit. I'm going to add just a touch more cream. I always add butter. To my uh, to my mashed potatoes, so I'm going to go ahead and do that as well. I probably got two and a half tablespoons in there. I'm going to season it with salt. Potatoes I think can use a good amount of salt and a good amount of black pepper. And then our special little ingredient is I just got a uh, a piece here of blue cheese. You can use whatever style blue cheese you want. This happens to be a, a Danish blue. It's just what I have. If you have Gorgonzola, if you have Rockford, if you have Maytag, whatever you want, you can add it in there, super simply. And then we just stir all those ingredients together. And you know, once you make it a few times, you can tell right away, you know, whether it's uh, whether it's dry, whether it's wet. You know, it's easy to add additional ingredients, whether it be butter or cream or salt or pepper. So start light, and then uh, then work up to it. I can tell these potatoes are a little bit dry for me. So I'm going to add just another tablespoon of cream, pat of butter, that one, you know, a small, just a little teaspoon. Oops, you get a little splash there. And then it'll take, you know, with the heat on, it'll take uh, maybe five minutes of incorporating for that blue cheese to just kind of melt right into the, um, right into the potatoes and give you a nice, beautiful, creamy texture. You give it a little taste mm, and you really get that you know that cheesy essence in there. A little bit of funkiness with blue cheese which is uh, which is absolutely awesome. Okay let's serve up our blue cheese mashed potatoes. You just lump them right in the plate here if you're doing it family style. Make a nice big helping. You can see the you um, may not be able to pick it up on camera but you can certainly see little lumps of green um, from the blue cheese and then if you want you know you can just speck it around with a few extra pieces of blue just so people know what they're eating there's some blue cheese mashed potatoes I'll see you next time on No Recipe Required